Guess what, guys? Universal Yums time! Welcome back, homemakers, to another day. I hope your week was great. We ended our week with a nice surprise at our door. We needed it. It has been a long week for our family. Let's just say our fridge went out, so this is kind of a nice little treat that doesn't have to be refrigerated. <laughs> so, this one was kind of cool. Um, first to start off with, Universal Yums, if you don't know what this is, it's a monthly subscription box from countries around the world. You pay for your subscription, you get a new box each month. I will include our link down below if you want to try it out. I highly suggest it. It is very fun. It is very fun. Yeah. So this month is from... Where do you think it's from? Egypt. Yes. I think it's from Egypt. <laughs> I knew it. Correct. Egypt. It is from Egypt. So we have quite a few things. It comes with your little card here that tells about it, where the countries it's from, and your little no, booklet. I'll lay them out. Okay, you lay it out. That's some interesting ones. These, I think, will be very interesting. Very. I don't think, I think this one's going to be really fun. Oh, wow, that's like a proper box. Of Ooh, that is a... Angles are just going to be like the short Butter, bread. shortbreads? I don't care. Pretzels? Ooh. Very interesting. Ooh, I like pretzels. Ooh, these look fun. Look at Butter. these. I I keep seeing pictures of these and I've been wanting to try them really bad. Mm. It's like apple. Mm. Okay. Oh, big, big little Those big bars. Big bars. Mm. Everything in this box looks really good. Actually. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. I'm really excited. There's, this is this box is actually a new one for Universal Yums. They have never had an Egypt box. So that was kind of cool to have something new because a lot of people who have had subscriptions with them haven't had, they tend to get repeats. And you can opt out for what that. What was our last country? Last one was Thailand. That oh, one yeah, was Thailand. a very unique box. I really want to go to Thailand, but there was a lot of food in that box that I didn't necessarily, not dislike, but I, I didn't was, enjoy I it. could do or do without. And these snacks all look very good. And of course, obviously, I, I want to go to Egypt. Mm -hmm. I would love to go to Egypt that's, and see the that's pyramids. That's kind of one of them that we've wanted I have to go wanted to. to go see the pyramids since I was a kid, so this is exciting. So, who started a lot? Jaden's? We did Trin. Jaden, you can pick first. Oh, I don't know what to pick first. I want to do this one. Okay. A type of puff, but can you see these guys on there? It's just hilarious. They're just, like, just says crazy tomato. Tomato puffs, I think. Like a Cheeto, maybe? I love Cheeto puffs. <laughs> oh, no. Don't say what it smells like to you. Because I know exactly what this smells like to me. Smell that. It smells like ketchup. Yeah. A ketchup puff. This should be interesting. Okay. Ketchup, no, it Cheeto. smells like pizza. As long as pizza? Homemade pizza. Here. Oh, yeah. That hot pocket you made. Well, it is tomato. These are, they look like Cheetos. Yeah. Ready? Oh. A little more dense than a Cheeto. Wow. I like those. I don't, that is a lot of punch. That's a lot of flavor. I like my crispy snacks to be flavorful. Not your favorite? Not the greatest thing. I'll eat it if I have to, but otherwise. No, Jaden? It's like what you said at the beginning, like, you could do with or without. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's put that in. Okay. On the right. next one. This one this one looks like a bugle type snack. Again with the faces. Mind yeah. <laughs> Mind blowing pizza. Oh, Oh, that smells like supreme pizza. Oh, that smells like Valentino's. That's one of our local pizza places. Yeah, this there's like Reminds me of like this pizza, the so pizza good. chips from the. You know when you store. walk into a pizza buffet, <laughs> this is what it smells like. Yeah, actually, it does. Imagine right. walking to every pizza buffet. Okay. Mm. That does not taste like a pizza. This does it taste exactly like a supreme pizza. I can taste olive, green pepper. Okay, and you have to get to the aftertaste. 
I don't mind the aftertaste of that. The first bite of it, though, not impressed. I'm amazed you can get that many flavors on a chip, though. There's a lot of different flavors going on. You think of, like, Willy Wonka's little gum that has, like, all the flavors of the meal? I really feel like that's what it was like. Jayden, pick away. I kind of want to keep on with the chips. Okay. Um, this is actually popcorn. Oh, ooh. Burning okay. barbecue. Um. Ooh. I think it's gonna be good. That's fine. I'm gonna take a couple of these. Yeah, it smells like barbecue chips. It smells like barbecue popcorn. Yeah, it does. Ready? Oh. Mmm. I like that. A lot. <laughs> Spicy. I don't have any water. There you go. No? <clears throat> no. Like it? I'm happy I did not shove it in my mouth. <laughs> that's not even... That's, that's mm. really good. That's how... That is a really... It's good, but spicy. spicy. It's got a little heat to it. I don't mind that. That's actually really good. I think we should try to make our own barbecue popcorn. That's good. That's really All good. Right, my turn. You want to do the other chip? No. Oh. Those are candy ones. We'll save those for last. Okay. That one? Good bark. Yep. Um, dates. Dates? Soft biscuits filled with date paste. Yeah, that's like a big news I'm guessing. Have I ever like, had a date before? Do you have a girlfriend? No! I was, what you, as I was saying, I was afraid <laughs> you were going to say that because I just thought about that. Like the it smells like cake. a big mutant. Have I ever had one before? I love big oh, There's two bars. Here, you guys want to split one? Mm -hmm. I love big. Yeah, You've had it. It's a big bar. Movies. I'm going to love this. It's a big one. That's what I said. Here. Okay, let's try it. Oh, it's crumbly. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Heaven. Mmm. That's good. I'm not sure this. This one is Duetto, little date bar. This is really good. It's a little bit drier than a Fig Newton. Mm-hmm. I kind of like it. Like the cookie part of it's a little bit drier. It's like almost a cookie. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I love oh. the Fig Newtons. Mm-hmm. Look. <laughs> That's a really good one. I was not scared of that. I was just like, no. All right. What do you think I did it? What does it say? Let's see. Chili and lemon. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Oh, wow. Very lemony. I think these are going to be really good. I like those those lemon chips. Oh, Was it Thailand where wow. we had the lemon I chips? Mean, there's some little ones in there. I'm, yeah. learning, I'm learning from these boxes that like lemon is the like their vinegar. Yeah, and it's it's good. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's good. Oh. Give me another chip. <laughs> oh no! I got, I got it. I got it in my throat. Mmm. I really got it in my throat. Okay, stop. Break a second. Let's all get a drink. Can you hand me that soda? I think there's still a little bit in there. Very lemony. Little little heat to them. Take a sip. Mm. Sip. <laughs> well, apparently one of our children thinks it's a little spicy. A little? I like heat. I really liked those. I like those. I like those a lot. I'm not so much partial to heat, but I don't know. That's not a high heat. It's like a low burn. A low burn, and then that lemon afterwards yeah. really just cuts that. Very good. It, like, stops it. Which one's it's it? It's called is? Tiger. Tiger, chili, and lemon. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm good. Pounces on 
I'll eat those later. My turn? Mm-hmm. <clears throat> oh, butter and herbs. Well, let's get this one. This is a cool trout. Oh, I'm really excited for those, too. I can open it. This is a, it's called Wave. Looks like just like a wafer, but it's got... Hazelnut. Hazelnut. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm really excited about this. Chocolate-covered wafer with hazelnut cream. Mm -hmm. Oh, boy. It's a little, little melty. Oh, oh boy. It's oh, going to be... It's a little bit melty. <laughs> Can you get it? Oh, yeah. Oh, they're burning this way. Mm. Oh. oh, no. Oops. Man down. I'll fill it. I'm just gonna eat it. Okay, eat it. Oh man, I'm not a huge fan of hazelnut. Mm. Oh, this is so messy. It's like a wafer cookie with Nutella. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nothing super special about that one. No, it's good though. Mm-hmm. Messy. Mm -hmm. How would you be able to make this yourself? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I have to edit this one. <laughs> Holy cow. I have a lot of hazelnut. Hazelnut. Serving size, one package. How could you eat a whole package? That was good. <laughs> it was good. Mm -hmm. it, it's just a wafer with Nutella. Yep. So That was good, though. Nothing really out of the ordinary, but it was definitely good. Yeah. I've actually never seen it. Who picked that one? You did. Oh, yeah, I did. <laughs> All right. Mom's pick. No, it's Jaden's pick. Oh, Jaden's pick. Sweet, because I wanted this coconut one. I remember the, oh. last, the last time. Yeah, this is, um... I think we saw some left. Coconut yeah. chocolate. Oh. Two... Oh, chocolate? Chocolate-covered coconut bar. Coconut, I'm trying to make Thank you for getting this over with, Jaden. It's not gonna be that bad. Oh. Coconut. Oh. Oh. This literally looks like an. It looks like marshmallow. Marshmallow. I didn't expect that. Here. Coconutty marshmallow. Oh, it smells like a marshmallow. Right? Yeah. Oh boy. Mmm. For me, just buy some coconut. It's actually really good. It's like a coconut marshmallow. Mm -hmm. mm. I wish that was our Easter candy. That? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. That's not sweet. Like, that's mm -mm. the consistency of a marshmallow, but like light, mm -hmm. like a coconut. Everything you wish a coconut would be. Gyro. It's called Gyro. That's good. That was really good. Yeah. One of the very yeah, first. That's my favorite so far. One of my very yeah, first coconut, coconut things that I really like. Yeah. I like those coconut chips. Yeah. Right. Not as much as I like this. Um, my turn? Mm-hmm. Okay. Butter cookies. Butter, butter. It says qu classic quality butter cookies. The cinnamon cookie. Oh, cinnamon oh, butter cinnamon. cookie. That's a hearty box. This is just, yeah, it's that's a, a full-on box. Full-on box of cookies. And, and if we like them, we got Thanks, boxes. Egypt. Hey. Oh. Fortune for our family. Can you imagine this at a gourmet <laughs> restaurant? <laughs> if I'm saying that right. Can you put that down there? Mm-hmm. I can already tell these would be good with coffee. Oh my yes. goodness. You know what this? It smells like a spice cake. Oh yeah. It smells good. Bottoms up. Oh, it's hard. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to put it in. Mm-hmm. No, it's there. Coffee cookie. Mm. It tastes like a pumpkin pie cookie. Mm-hmm. A little bit. Yeah. It's basically what it is. Yeah. It's good. Mm-hmm. How's your trip? Jaden. Good. Your pick. What that was his pick. No. Trent picked that one. Huh. Your pick. Jaden, you can pick. Pretzels. Pretzels? 
I like the pretzel. Butter and herbs pretzels. Pretzo. Is it called pretzel? Oh yeah, it is. Pretzo. <laughs> pretzo. Pretzo. Mmm. Oh, that's got a very buttery smell to it. I'm not normally a pretzel person, but I'm not one. either. I am. Oh, I got sure you got one. Ready? It's a lot. I didn't smell. Mmm. Okay. I could get behind these pretzels. Not a lot of flavor to me. No, the but the flavor it's... is more aromatic than actual like flavor. I Ooh. like though. Ooh. They're not salty. It's not like a salty, salty pretzel. Oh, you're right. There's like no salt on them. I appreciate that. I love these. It's like just flavor. Uh huh. I really like that. I like those. I'm not a not pretzel. Bad. I'm not a pretzel person, but not bad, but not my favorite. I don't mind that. I like those. I like those. <laughs> I like those. I like those. This one. This one is wafers filled with halva and coffee cream. White chocolate covered wafer with cocoa cream. Jane, I'll eat your part if you don't want it. Okay. Jane, I'll eat your part if you don't. I want know it. you don't like coffee. Awesome. That's a big wafer. That is a ginormous wafer. Yep, just a big wafer. <clears throat> hmm. Trina. Smells like a wafer. Oh. Meager. A small mistake. Try to keep it equal. Fair enough. It doesn't. It doesn't taste like coffee. No. I like coffee. I didn't use it, but. Mm. Sort of. I like it. I have the rest of that. <laughs> I like that. I don't mind that. That wasn't anything spectacular for me. I like it. Bit before it's finished. I like that it wasn't mm -hmm. like, no, it's fine. You can eat it. I like that it's not a heavy, a really heavy wafer cookie. Yeah, it was very light. It was a Salt colon. Three smiley faces. For me, no liking coffee yet again, something I don't like. Alright. Let's make it. Can do this one? Sure. Let me find that one. Yeah. Wafer biscuits filled with chocolate and coated with. Oh, white that was. Chocolate. I read the wrong one. That's what this one is. I read oh. the wrong description. White chocolate covered wafer with cocoa. Oh, cream. yeah, okay. No wonder my brain was like, this isn't coffee. <laughs> this is good. Way to go, brain. That's right. Don't really make things easy to open. <laughs> Disclaimer, don't open things with your teeth. This one's a little melty too, I think. Yeah. Well. <laughs> I love white chocolate so much. <clears throat> oh no. I like white chocolate as well. White chocolate's my favorite. Okay. There you go. Oh, my teeth are hurting already looking at this. Okay. Ready? Yep. Hmm. Mm. That's a weird taste. Because it's not like a white chocolate like we're used to. Mm hmm. Yeah. A little bit lighter. I like it. I don't like that one. I'll eat it, but that'll take it. Yeah, not my fave. I, like I don't really it. like that one. Um, not you. Me either. All right, so this is seasonal. This one. For the boys. Okay. These are gummy green apple strips. Oh, oh my gosh, this smells so good. I'm really excited about these. Whoa. I'm really excited. It smells like I'm eating it. That has like huge aroma. Oh. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm. Flavor. If you could make a 
pull and peel Twizzler from Apple. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, it's not a strong apple flavor, but it's nice. Has way more aroma, like both yeah. the pretzels. Mm-hmm. Way more aroma, like when you smell it, than it does actual taste. Yeah. So, wow, that box went quick. I'm really sad. That box went way too quick. Way too quick. Yeah. So anytime you get your Universal Yums, you have your little booklet. This has a mixture of different activities and things about the countries. My kids really like looking through this. You can also see more information about whatever has come in your box. Sorry if you can hear the thunder. We're in a thunderstorm watch right now. That's what we do on stormy nights. Yep. And you also have access to the Yum Shop. So if you find something that you like, you can always get it at the Yum but Shop. a little disclaimer, they mm-hmm. uh, charge a lot. There was um, from the, the UK, UK boxing, Brianna loved one of the products. So we looked it up to order it and it was marked up so much from their Yum Shop. And it was way, way cheaper on just Amazon. So do your research. You know, if it's worth for you doing the Yum Shop, by all means, support Universal Yums. Otherwise, look through other outlets. Yeah. So it is fun to do though, and we we are looking forward to it every month. In fact, I just said to Brianna that I feel like we just did the Thailand one, and this one was here before we knew it. So that's mm-hmm. fun. Yeah, really great. It'd be fun to go to these countries someday and maybe find some of these items. Yeah. Well, what do you guys, Trin? What do you give this box? Thumbs up, middle, or down? Thumb, two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. There's a lot of good things. Some of them were men, some of them were okay. Most of them were really good. Okay. Pretzel boy, <laughs> thumbs up. <laughs> this is interesting. My children don't eat pretzels, so this is kind of a big deal that we're just munching on pretzels here. Interesting. Jaden, so you said thumbs up? Yeah. Okay, Dad? Um, I liked everything in the box. I did, like, as far as taste. My problem with it I really thought being from Egypt, we'd have a little more exotic type products like we did from Thailand. The, you're talking flavors? Yeah, I mean, mm-hmm. a lot of these items are really similar to items that we could get here in the States. Kind of thought we'd have a little more, I don't know, just different things, I guess. Okay. So, but yeah. I did, flavor-wise, I liked everything. I would, I'd give this one a thumbs up. I agree. I, I was kind of hoping for... A few more unique snacks than this. I mean, some of this is very similar to things that we already have. But I do like the... the I do like the change up of flavors and, and like, the different types of white chocolates and, and yeah. some of that thing. But, I don't know. It wasn't... It wasn't the most amazing. Like, I was really excited for Thailand. But it, I think it was a good run. I mean, if you can get a whole pizza and a chip. All right, so that is all for this edition of The Nebraskan Wife. If you haven't already, like and subscribe, share it with your family. If you want to try your own Universal Yums, just check out our link below and you can get a little discount on your first box. Bye. Bye. Bye.